Good morning. We have a big day planned, so let's get up. First things first, I need to open this window and brighten it up in here. Much better. Morning huddle, game plan time. I have my breakfast so I don't go hungry. <laughs> And I'm drinking my coffee out of this mug that says it's an add to cart kind of day because we're shopping. But we're not doing just any shopping. I have curated a long list of most of the Austin thrift and vintage stores. And I want to go to most of them today and get many, many things. But for now, I'm going to get ready because I kind of need to hurry to be at the Goodwill bins at 9 a.m. when they open. So I'm gonna do my makeup, get dressed, and then check back in with you guys. I'm back and I'm ready. I really need to leave like right now so that I can stop and get gloves. But first, a quick fit check. I have boxers, t-shirt, hat, super simple. I'm gonna be like taking my clothes on and off all day. It sounded weird. Get that out of your head. You nasty. But let's go. I made it to Goodwill five minutes early and I don't know who I think I am thinking I'd be the only one here. There's a line around the building, but it's fine. We're here. I stopped and I got these gloves. They didn't have like latex gloves and these are kind of big, but I wasn't stopping anywhere else. So these will have to do and I'm afraid it's going to be a madhouse in there. There's going to be people pushing and if someone pushes me, I might just cry. So I'll update you guys how it's going as I'm in there, hopefully, and then a big update when I get back. Oh my God, be so for real. The line is moving and we're going in now. Okay, here for an update. I have a handful of stuff. I just don't know what I'm gonna get yet. And this place is crazy. I've been here for like an hour and I'm sweating. Finally done with the Goodwill bins. That was crazy, but first we need to take care of a little business. I came out to my car and there's literally a dead bird, like right in front of my car. And there's an alive bird standing next to it. It's mate, I'm guessing. And so let's take a moment of silence for the bird. Now back to business. I'll show you what I ended up getting at the end of the video. Sorry to be that girl. We are officially at our next destination. This place is called Thrift Center. And the reviews on this one say that it's like a super little hole in the wall. Not a lot of people know about it. They have like cute knickknacks. Knickknacks. And furniture. And so we're just gonna go check it out. <laughs> back here so let's just get to the dressing room try these things on then i'm gonna go to like the vintage stores this basic abercrombie tank it feels like new i think i might as well get it it's only seven dollars this is where it gets kind of crazy this is a kid's jersey <laughs> but i kind of like it like i think it's cool or there's more of like the baby tee version. I could like cut it, make it shorter. Ugh, I'm torn. We're leaving a little bit later than I hope. There's like eight minutes until 12 when all the vintage shops open, but that's okay. I'm gonna go head to all the vintage shops vintage shops i want to go to or by ut so let's drive there also if you notice something different about my hair my clear tie popped in the middle of that store so i had to improvise move it or lose it people gotta love the austin traffic that skyline is worth all of the traffic though made it to the next one i think this one is gonna be more of like hand-picked vintage that's like gonna be a little bit more expensive. Ooh, 
They just rolled out. Sale five dollar rack. I gotta go. Okay, I'm back in my car. I'm not gonna lie, that place was like kind of disappointing because they had really cool stuff in there, but like, just not the wave I'm on today. But there's a couple more in this area that I wanna go check out. I don't know if they'll be the same vibe, probably, but maybe they'll have cooler stuff. So let's go. <laughs> Harry, not now. Hey, this place looks sick. And there's another vintage store literally right there. I'm liking the vibes in here. My 10 year old self would die over this. These are sick. No way. Oh my God. These are so cute. Salt and pepper shakers. <sighs> I'm walking to the next one and a guy just drove by me in a van and looked at me. He looked just like Jeffrey Dahmer. Hardy, hardy. Oh my god, it's so blazing hot. It's so hot. And I'm getting hungry. I'm sick of the vintage stores. It's just, the stuff in there is super sick, but it's not what I'm looking for today. Not the vibe. Also, don't want to spend $30 on each thing I get. And the last one I just went into had like super cool Tommy like jackets, but not for $100. I mean, it's probably worth that much. I don't know, but not for me, not for me. Let's regroup. Let's see if you will sit up there and drive with me. I guess not. Possible last stop of the day. It's really big. Well, if it's free, it's for me. Just kidding. These remind me of Peter Pan. Peekaboo, Louis Vuitton. I really like that watch. Um, casual? No matters. These shirts have to be matching. Read it. Read it. Oh my god, this car just pulled out of the parking lot and literally these like, the thing right there where you put the cart, she went in between them. I don't know how she didn't smack it and then pull out and smack me. Hee <laughs> hee, I lied. I'm at the last one now to Salvation Army only because it's right by where I'm gonna get food like literally minutes down the road. So I have to. Also, I've never been to a Salvation Army, but here we go. This place is huge. I'm already lost in the sea of furniture. Seriously, cannot do this anymore. I need food. Thank God. I got Hawaiian bros. And in Austin, there's only a ghost kitchen location, which sucks because I love Hawaiian bros. I just recently tried it for the first time because I did like a little collab with them. <laughs> and, but I love the Dole soft serve and they discontinued it at this location. How sad! Ah! Mmm, musubi. Please look at this. I mean, come on. But I'm gonna eat and then let's do a little recap of our thrift vintage day, shall we? First, we need a celebratory jam session for getting through the day. <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay, I'm finally back home. Let's go through everything I got today. First, this hat. I just thought it was cool with the denim and the red. It says Grand Casino. And then I lost my just like plain white, like basic button down to go over like bathing suits and stuff. And I found the perfect one. It's super wrinkly, but it's like the perfect linen material. I'll save those for last. Um, this sweater, I literally like it's to die for. It's that brand Union Bay. I like looked it up and it's a pretty cool brand, but I'm actually obsessed with this. This skirt, it's like very Coachella and I got it on purpose because ACL is coming up soon. And I thought this would be kind of sick. Then this like baby tee spurs. I love all spurs merch. This tank top was literally $3. And it's a navy color. I don't know if you could tell, but it is a navy color. And if you guys hear that ringing, my sister's calling me. Okay. So this is a navy color tank top. Oh my God, pull oh, yourself yeah. together. It's so thick. Like the quality is amazing. This basic Dickies uh, black zip up. The last thing. This thing is gonna, this is my little fun experimentation object. Ready? That's all I got. I hope you guys enjoyed doing today with me in my first vlog. I literally went to like close to 10 vintage and thrift stores today. So I'm exhausted, but you guys made it fun. Thank you, and thank you for watching my very first YouTube video. Like and subscribe and comment if you want, I guess. Bye!